Come on. Tell me you were sick, that shit it pulled me. Come on, come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Say it in my head and it rolls me now. Thanks for showing me now. Uh huh. Can't nobody talk shit like my old nigga. He'll call you outside just to fuck with you. Yeah. Talk basketball. Man. Yeah, yo, 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 yo. What's up, good people of all America? This your boy D Good coming from IDB Time Production. So, boy Jetta Villa, Jetta Villa, since I know him since middle school. You feel me? One of my day one partners. But, anyways, we're not here to speak on his history. We are here to speak on his new beginning. And a new beginning that, uh, that he got going on, he will be dropping his new album June the 12th. But before the new album come, we will, uh, I will be interviewing my dude. Yes, interviewing my dude, a special, a special. He, we will, we are going to discover uh, what the album mean to him. Not only what the album mean to him, but why he spit so many lyrics through his album. You feel me? He got this one song called "My Old Old Nigga." You feel me? And uh, I really, I really rock with that song. You know what I'm saying? That song is pretty much him and him and his father having a relationship, uh, a special bond relationship. And me personally, I never had a father, but I do have kids, and I want to do that for my kids. So we just gonna speak on the relationship between his father, his mother, the the relationships with with himself, the streets, and everything that he got going on coming. So please stay tuned. Coming soon. The interview will uh, please stay tuned for my boy uh interview man. We need a we need a support. Support, support, support. My dude locally, he from H Town, Audubon, Humble, Texas. Yes, it all together is still Houston, Texas, you know what I'm saying? Just Houston, just big. But I really feel like he got a mission and I feel like he can uh really I feel like he can inspire a lot of youngsters and uh, older people that was already out here, you know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, man, we have to support our people regardless of the situation. So let's do that. I mean, sell one album, it mean the most to me because of the fact, because, because of the fact that he believed in his goals and he delivered. Regardless of any situation, Jedevelli delivered, you know? So we need to support. You know, he uh, he ain't famous, but he famous to me, and he should be famous to you. So, man, give my boy a chance. Listen to his music. Understand where he come from, and know that, hey, give my boy a chance. And, and, and you never know where it, where it gonna come from. Hey, if you ain't, if you ain't, if you ain't get him an album, man, you lying. You niggas lying. Not in my language. Come on. Come on. You see how I say y'all niggas lying? It came, it, it, it came in. You see that? 